biggest occasions on our football calendar, Soweto Derby, number 166. A lot of excitement. We'll have an opportunity to hear from both of the coaches. My name is Julia Stewart, and I'll be hosting proceedings this afternoon. Hello, everybody. Hi. Thank you very much. Obviously, I mean, we, we, we lost the past three games, of which is not a good feeling when it comes to, to the history of these this, this, this games. We, we have the pedigree, pedigree to... to to, 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 to actually win, win, win this kind of games. Come Saturday, the battle is on. We're going to give our all. I'm sure the, 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 the boys are ready and you could see the energy we have in the team. But for us, I think uh, what keeps us down, I think it's a commitment that uh, we always uh, put at, at training and uh, we work hard, you know, and uh, we humble ourselves. You know, and uh, push and push each and every day, you know, try to get results <coughs> each and every game, you know, and uh, yeah, we take uh, step by step. I would like to see more commitment. I would like to see more bravery. I would like to see uh, more ambition, more focus. We have uh, done our preparation so far, I think not in a different way. We analyzed the last games. Definitely something uh, that we should be well prepared for the game. But this is a totally different ball game. Uh, different coaches there. Players are the same that they want to uh, prove the point and they have certain pressure because it was not easy for them to accept last year. In respect to, uh, as I told last time, the biggest power given to us is power of making people happy. Huge army of our supporters that are praying, supporting us and living life for our respective institutions, in this case from our side to Orlando Pirates. We know what is meaning this derby to them. We want to come out and uh, we don't want to allow stone unturned. It will be a very hard match, small details we decide, but we want to do anything possible. As colleague said that details are going on our side and we shall try our the best. My first experience uh, for the first Soweto derby it uh, was amazing, it was amazing. Uh, unfortunately, we lost, uh, but uh, atmosphere and everything, uh, it's, it was amazing. And uh, I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward to, to actually celebrate afterwards, walking out of the pitch in such a big crowd with a victory. This is not going to be an easy game to play. I mean, playing Kaiser Chiefs at FNP hasn't been easy, so Looking at the previous results of the Davies, that's going to make it even worse. It's going to make it even more difficult. And Kaiser Chiefs is playing at home, so chances are they're going to come out gun blazing. They have a new coach, so previous results don't really matter. Of course, the excitement uh, in the dressing room, the excitement uh, on the floor of Kaiser Chiefs, uh, at the Natarina village uh, is, is outstanding. Everybody wants to be part of it, everybody wants to be in the starting 11. Uh, unfortunately, we have to make decisions. Some players will be not starting, some players will be coming in, in uh, into the second uh, half uh, game. And let's see, uh, I think actually support each other, covering each other and really uh, being a united uh, powerhouse, that's really something what I hope we will see on Saturday afternoon. On behalf of ABSA and everybody in the football fraternity in South Africa, we did want to share uh, with Kaiser Chiefs that our thoughts are with them and especially go out to Wiseman Meiwa and we know that he will be top of mind of everybody uh, when they take the field on Saturday and uh, I'm sure many of you will be getting the thoughts of Willard about that and we just wanted to uh, let him know that we are thinking about him and we send our best wishes.